Ooh, welcome to another throwback here on Throwback Gaming. I am Johnny Gamewell, bringing you Hitman Codename 47 for the PC. Released in 2000 by IO Interactive and published by IDOS, as you can see here. This game was a pretty good entry into the stealth action genre. Certainly not revolutionary by any means, but it's level-based approach. You can buy weapons at the beginning of each level with the amount of money, depending upon how well you did in the prior level. It's a fresh approach and a Overall, again, a pretty goddamn good game. So, uh, without further rambling from myself, let's enjoy this awesome intro scene. Let's get started. Very nice. Now, it has been a while since I played this game. I did play it a little bit to get some of the settings all prepped up. There you go, you can see that profile there, but in general, I haven't played this game since it was released, and yes, I actually did buy it back in the day, but I bought it on a Steam sale, and uh, here we go. Okay, let's do uh, Codename 47, right? Perfect. You know I love my games hard, so here we go. Sixteen years later. Wake up, wake up, my friend. It's the dawn of a new day, and you have things to do. I will guide, teach you, and you will learn my way. Always remember, I am not only your guide and mentor. Think of me as the person you trust the most. The skills you learn today will not only be useful, but vital for performing the tasks I have chosen for you. You see, you have been carefully selected. You are very special to me. That's a nice pool of blood down there. It's a pretty fucked up intro when you think about it. Here you go. You are learning fast, my friend. I knew you would. Now, go and find some clothes to put on. Look at that. Ta-da. Take those clothes. Remember a lot of clothes changing in this game. Go to the door and you are doing very well. Next task is to enter the next room. Okay. Boom. Good. As you can see, things are moving. See? That wasn't oh. so hard, was it? You are doing just fine, my friend. Now continue the next exercise. Okay. Is that the tie waving around? Remember these graphics were pretty good for circa 2000. I think the game was released in November 2000. Excellent. And uh, pretty good graphics. Very good. You are doing just fine. Now take the elevator and let's continue to the next lesson. Look at that, some real time lighting effects there. Pretty snazzy. It's like I'm living in 1998. God help me. Subjected to uh, endless, ludicrous rap videos. You are an excellent pupil, my very best so far. But then again, I knew you would be. We are now moving on to more complicated issues. I'm sure you are ready for it. Look at this. Very good. A pentagon or your own knife. Excellent choice. Not bad. You would... Excellent. Yeah. Very excellent. There it's you go. To, it's time to move on, my friend. Proceed with the next item. It's time to... It's time to... It's time to move on, my friend. Proceed with the next item. 
Let's move on when I say this. Oh, look at that. Dead. No way. Are you kidding me? Way too much fun. Alright, so you can't get him from the front. That makes sense. Look at that. Oh. Oh, it's gonna be nasty. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. You are an excellent pupil. It is a pleasure to see you at work. At this speed, you will soon have perfected your skills. I mean all of your efforts and results. Keep this up, and you will be second to none. Now go to the table and choose your weapon. Alright. Here we go. Pick up hard baller. Excellent. An AMT hard baller. A fine stainless steel version of the court government 1911A. With its seven rounds of 45 ACP, it is a powerful package. This guy likes his guns. Now let's try it out, shall we? And be wary of the recoil. Needless to say, this is not the door. Here, let's just grab it all. Yeah, hold it. Here we go. That nice, beautiful lighting effects on the bald head. Here we go. Boom. All right, let's try the other one. Not very accurate. Good. A fine semi-automatic nine millimeter pistol. This model is used by military and law enforcement units worldwide. It holds 15 rounds in a clip. Now, load it. Right, here we go. Now a little bit louder. Alright. Should be enough to take somebody down. Alright, let's do this. Soon this is a big boy over here. A desert eagle. Ah, a very fine choice. A sturdy and noisy companion. But you will still get the last word in most discussions with this one. It's a point five oh action express with a capacity of school. Now for some target and reloading practice. Yep. Step over to the shooting range. I've been trying to let him talk, but God damn it, I just had to pick up the ammo. Here we go, Desert Eagle. I like how they use real names. Back in the day, real gun names was more or less unheard of in video games. Remember this game, again, for its time, many, many years ago, had a more of a simulation feel to it almost. Which is pretty damn cool. You are an excellent specimen. Your yeah. performance is remarkable, and I must say I am impressed. Yeah, also, I had high hopes for you from the beginning. Now the training becomes much more refined. In this mock-up, you will encounter friends as well as enemies. Your objective here is to discern between them as you make your way through this maze armed with a submachine gun. You can practice single shots as well as controlled bursts of three to four rounds. Now, pick up the weapon and load it. And remember, no more single hand action. No trying to conceal it and forget about the neatness with these scatter guns. Alright. Pick up the MP. Is that an MP5? Excellent. A very persuasive item. Good. Now find Shit. your way through this city. Red is for bad guys. Bad the guys. of a discerning connoisseur when a high profile like the Israeli swears by then you know it is quality hard right, here we go this submachine gun is a caliber 9mm by 19 paradigm or 45 ACP has a magazine capacity of 20 25 Jesus he's gonna keep talking isn't it? operation closed breach with oh. 45 bit size is 17.1 oh shit empty. Rear aperture sides adjustable for windage and front post adjustable for elevation. Now I'm locking and shooting. Oh shit. K 
killed the civilian. I don't know how to do the... Change the... Firing mode. Oh. oh. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at that. You can actually see the uh, thing set up. Pretty cool. A lot of detail went into this, clearly. Alright, oh, there's one there. Yeah. Boom. 45, that seems pretty abysmal. Alright, let's, let's keep going. I'm going back up. Congratulations! This? Only the best of the best reach this level. All previous levels will seem crude and base compared to the complicated and refined tactics needed to perform well at this point. These exquisite, finely tuned sniper rifles are easy to conceal as they can be separated and assembled within minutes with a snap-on action. In this special shooting range, you will experience conditions very similar to situations you will encounter after the completion of your education here. Single shot action is what you do here. Short, sharp, and sweet. Now approach the table and pick a rifle to practice with and check out how to load and assemble it. This affordable pump action shotgun is a surefire hit within 50 meters. If you prefer adjustable open sights, the Monte Carlo stock promotes fast sight alignment. And this guy knows a shitload about these weapons, it seems. Let's see. Looks like a buckshot. Damn. Alright, let's take the AK. I picked a classic and longtime favorite for warring factions around the world. This weapon was developed for the Russian motor infantry and adopted for service by the Soviet Army in 1949. Jesus. Kalashnikov and the year. Not very accurate. It's a very simple and sturdy sort of big power. No frills. Yeah, no kidding. Here we go. Oh yeah, I have to load it. Yeah. Damn. Alright, let's use the sniper rifle. The R-93 Tactical covers a wide range of applications owing to its outstanding accuracy over long distances. The fast, simple handling is in this case an indispensable safety and security factor. Alright, here we go. Bullseye? Pretty damn close. Eight points. So you can actually, oops, shit. What am I doing here? There we go. I try to read, see what the bullseye is. Fuck. Controls are fucking with me. Jesus Christ. Maybe it's the beer, I don't know. There we go, load that sucker up. 13? 15? Hold on. Let's clear that shit. Yeah, that was definitely a bullseye. I can't hit the bullseye from here, I'm in trouble. Boom. Almost right in the center. Yeah, so I got that in the bullseye too. I don't know why it says a different value then. Alright. 
I don't know, that one didn't even count. Who the fuck knows what's going on? Alright, pretty well armed here. We might have to kill some dudes. If I remember correctly, there's a dude waiting at the top, or there's a couple or something. I think you have to sneak by him. I'm just gonna blast him. Fuck it. Here we go. Oh, ooh. Man. <laughs> it's not quite physics, but I guess it was in its own way. I mean, that looked pretty good. I have to say, what the hell is this? A taser? Oh yeah, take his clothes. Everything holstered. Yeah, uh, yeah. Hello, sir. So it doesn't matter that I look completely different, right? Yeah. Yeah, love those graphics. Yeah. Sorry, buddy. I'm gonna get a Desert Eagle to the dome. Oh. Oh. Sorry, sir. Can I still shoot with the body? Oh, no. It's too bad. Alright, here we go. Oh, snap. Shadowy figure. Ah, so this is Hong Kong. People talk of it as an interesting place. Filled with mystery, laughs, and excitement, they say. Not really my scene. Man, that was... I know he's supposed to be dry, but that was delivered <laughs> pretty poorly, it seems. Jesus. Not much on the voice acting budget. Okay, yeah, looks like we're on to the first mission. So anyway, I'm going to do this one piecemeal, guys. I'm just going to break it up level by level because it is a level-based game. So anyway, thank you so much for joining me here on Throwback Gaming. I am Johnny Gamewell. We're gonna play through the original Hitman, codename 47. So if we got, hopefully you guys had a good time. I certainly had a blast. Even just playing through this beginning part, it's bringing back so many memories. And hopefully it is for you too. And if you're new to it, welcome. Welcome to this awesome game. So, without further rambling, take care guys. I'm Johnny Gamewell, this is Throwback Gaming. And I'll see you guys next time.